I'm uncertain as to what the future of DPS is going to be, and I think that there has to be a repository somewhere. And that's why Michael Williams is creating a museum focusing on Detroit Public High Schools, including his alma mater, Mumford. This is not about me. It's not about Mumford High School. This is about preserving the legacy of Detroit Public High Schools and the Detroit Public High School system. So he's removing the seats out of this bus, adding carpet, and turning it into a mobile museum. It'll be loaded with DPS artifacts like old yearbooks, old newspapers, and shirts autographed by alumni. We want them to say, wow, you know, I remember that. We need a place that you can come and see an old locker or see a brick from the old school. Especially because a lot of those schools no longer exist. In the last 10 years, more than 100 DPS schools have closed. Some were torn down and replaced with brand new buildings. Others left vacant and the rest were demolished. All of these schools just had stellar and regal architecture, so we want to be able to preserve exactly that in this museum. So you may not be able to drive by your old high school anymore, but a piece of your old high school could come to you. Michael Williams tells me he plans to have the first DPS mobile museum up and running by mid-November. But in the meantime, he's always looking for new items. So if you have any memorabilia or artifacts you want to donate or lend, head to our website, wxyz.com slash the now Detroit. In Detroit, Kristen Pierce, the now Detroit.